thing that just shouldn't be said. Words matter. People remember that. I was incessantly bullied in high school, being called a fag, faggot, hum out, spick, roach killer. And those words matter. That was some 47 years ago. And I remember those words as if they were yesterday. And so every time I get a, an invitation to a high school reunion, it goes right in the trash because I just can't go and see those people. So words matter, and I thought that that service was a beautiful service. It was a service of prayer. It was a service of unity. It was a service where people loved each other, and that's what we need to do in this era. That's what we're about. We respect and we love each other. And, you know, to the mayor's comments, that's how we get elected. You know, people elect us because they're open-minded. They look at qualifications, not whether you are a certain race, religion, creed, what have you. And so we have to be totally concerned about the words that we choose in school and teach our children tolerance and not to use those words because those words hurt. And I will tell you that in my case, after four years of being bullied and taunted, at the age of 17, I tried to commit suicide. And fortunately, I didn't succeed. But there are teens that do try to commit suicide and do succeed. And that is a permanent solution to a temporary problem. But the words matter. And so we have to teach children to be tolerant, to be patient, to be understanding, and to recognize that even though we're all different, when you cut someone, you bleed red.